You come along with your heart pounding. You think you can win like that? Hiya! I'll fight you. My foot's not in the shot. I'll fight you. I'm a true champion. What is going on, Crimson City? My name is Crimson Seabad, bringing you guys episode 16 of the Pokemon Platinum Egg Lock. If you guys are excited, show some love on the like button down below. If you guys are new, feel free to hit that subscribe button as well. I've got a question of the day right here for your faces for you. What is your favorite shiny Pokemon? We have a lot, a lot, a lot of uh, eggs that you guys sent in that were uh, shiny encounters. So I am curious to know what is your favorite shiny Pokemon? I'm a big fan myself of shiny Zygarde. I love the green and white. I'm looking forward to the event coming out soon where we can actually have a shiny Zygarde on our team uh, legitimately. Um, I'm also a big fan of Incineroar. I love the white and the red color scheme that it has going on there. And uh, I've grown to really enjoy shiny Suicune as well. I love that blue mane. You guys know I'm a huge Suicune fan, so... That is my question of the day for you guys. We did a little bit of grinding uh, in the last episode, or not between the last episode, excuse me. Do a little bit of a team recap. Nothing too much uh, has changed. Yanima level 30, she is. She has a timid nature with the compound eyes ability. Signal Beam, Silver Wind, Defog, and Pursuit. We have Luna the Espeon, she is level 28. A quirky nature with the synchronized ability. Grass Knot, Shadow Ball, Quick Attack, and Toxic. Sajaki the Kabuto, he is level 28 in adamant nature with the Swift Swim ability. Aqua Jet Return. Harden and Rock Tomb. Ren the Grottle. He is level 29 in Impish Nature with the Overgrow ability. Bite, Seed Bomb, Superpower, and Cuts. We have Anubis the Growlithe. He's level 27. A Docile Nature with the Flash Fire ability. Crunch, Flamethrower, Flare Blitz, and Flame Wheel. And last but certainly not least, the newest member of the team, Rash the Crow Gunk. He is a Jolly Nature with the Anticipation ability. Bullet Punch, a Fake Out, Headbutt, and Cross Chop. In this episode, uh, we're going to finish up. I'm going to toss a repel on because let me tell you how annoyed I am with all this stuff that's happening right now. Let me tell you how annoyed I am with all this stuff that's going on right now. There we go. There we go. And you know what? Let me show you guys. Let me introduce you guys to Rash. We're going to do that too if we find another trainer battle. I believe there's one more floor of this tower that we get to go to. And then we start making our way north. There's a few towns that we have to go to and all of that fun stuff. Happy Thursday to you all. I hope you're all having a fantastic day. I have fantastic news. By the time you guys are watching this, um, I believe the shiny race will have already happened on Twitch, but I have fantastic news regarding content on the channel. Your boy has joined yet another Pokemon League. Uh, I am replacing a coach I don't know if the official announcement has been made, but replacing a coach in the PGL. If you guys remember the PGL, uh, both seasons that we participated in, we were uh, we we made it to the championship and unfortunately lost. So hopefully taking over a team and there's only a few weeks left. I think it's maybe like four weeks left of battles. But uh, given the team and everything else, maybe we can make it to the championship again halfway through the season. I don't even know, but I'm really excited for that. That'll be on team builders will be on Thursdays and then Fridays will be the battle. And then you guys obviously know NPA is going on right now with the team builders on Friday and the battles are on Saturday. And then when P4G starts off, we're going to team build on Saturday and the battles on Sunday. Ah, there's some old ladies up here. Let's talk with them. Oh, the fog is gone. And with it all down in my heart, this is my thanks. Don't be shy. Take it. That Fentina, it's hard to tell what she's thinking, but she has a compassionate heart, you know. She's a regular visitor. Let me make your journey out of this place less frightening. Take the Oh, the spell tag and the cleanse tag. That's what we get. Got it, got it, got it. The lost towers where the spirits of departed Pokemon are put to rest. Those that enjoyed long lives, those whose times were short, all the departed Pokemon shall find solace here. Interesting. What are y'all really just chilling up here like this? And I can't even. What do the what do the what do the tags do? Remind me what the tags do. Uh, boost the power of ghost type moves. Ooh, so we can give that to. No, I don't want to give that to Rash. Uh, let's give Rash the cleanse tag, and then we'll give Luna the spell tag. And eventually, we can give Luna the mind plate since we do have that, which will start boosting as soon. Whenever she gets actual stab. You know, that's what we'll have to do. But in the meantime, the meantime, we can just carry on our way. I didn't even need to teach Yanima Defog. What is this? What is this? What is this malarkey? I don't know what malarkey is. <laughs> I have no idea what malarkey is, but it sounds like a word used to describe what is happening right here. 
Oh, my repels effect were off. Oh, no. All right. Oh, and somebody in the comment section the other day was like, when will Crimson Seabed be ready with his random number generator? Well, guess what? Uh, viewers at home. I'm opening it right now and I'm gonna keep it on my phone ready just in case um, Someone did tell me so we have a lot of encounters another person told me that uh, we do have an encounter in Eterna City We can fish for it and we do have the option to uh, go back for our um, Go back for our gosh darn let's battle some trainers So long as there's a road I'll keep okay. I guess you don't want to battle um, uh, We already did get our route 10 encounter yesterday uh, failed it because Chansey uh, did I buy pokeballs before we start venturing out, I did. I bought 20 gray balls. All right, cool, 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 cool. Um, we do get that encounter um, once we get fly. Can I figure out the controls to this game? Thank you. Um, once we get fly, we can go back. Eternity City, uh, the Flow Aroma honey tree that we put honey on, uh, the Old Chateau, and then Wayward Cave. Those are four encounters that we need to get, which are four eggs to hatch. Rancher Marco sent out his ponyta. All right. All right, Rash, I'm gonna need you to do that thing you do. He's so cheeky. I love what he just like, <laughs> he's just, he is just, he's a character. He's a character, that Rash. And we're still pretty on par with everything. Um, I don't really know where on earth the, um, what's it called? I don't really know where on earth uh, the next gym is in comparison to where we're at right now, but we'll, we'll get there when we get there. We can get there when we get there. Cross chop, goodbye. Oh, and I can use P the PP up on Rash's cross chop. I don't know why I didn't do that during, I don't know why I didn't do that during grinding. Let's go on ahead and use that. That's it, more the medicine pouch. Yeah. Yeah, let's uh, level up your cross chop. There we go, cool. Now we got more of those things. Now we got more of those things. Oh, there's so much, there's so much stuff going on. All these trainers that we can battle on the way. I think we're going the right way as well too. <laughs> I'll show you how tightly I've bonded with my daughter. I can get away with slacking off if I have my Pokemon out. Well, I mean, I guess you're playing with your Pokemon. You don't have to do chores, but... But, Ava and Matt. Ponyta and Rapidash. That's a... That's a tag team. So I actually don't want Rash to deal with this, because he already took a Flame Wheel. So we're going to go on to Sajaki. And then Luna's going to toss off a Spell Tag boosted Shadow Ball into that Rapidash. That looks good. Rapidash is always a Pokemon that I've wanted to try out in League format. Just talking about leagues and stuff like that. I've always wanted to try out Rapidash. Uh, good speed, I mean, you know, with things like agility and stuff. Um, I did, you know, a fire. Oh, hold the phone now. Um, just always had good speed. I mean, Flash Fire, Flame Body, two really good abilities. I'm mean, I really, you guys know, you guys know me. I love my, I love my, my draft league Pokemon. Hence why I said I'm never doing three draft leagues again. And then I saw a tweet last night where it was like, we're looking for a replacement coach. And I was like, go on. Like, I was like, it, it reminds me of the, the, the onion, um, the onion article where it's like the, uh, uh, how does this keep happening? Says the only country where it, there's no way to keep this from happening. Says the only country where it continually happens. Speaking about like the travesties that are going on in America and stuff like that. That's what that reminds me of. I'll never join three leagues again, says the coach that joins three leagues again. So the Detroit Side Null is coming to the PGL. Oh, we out here one shot. And there we go. At a girl, Luna. Calm down. Calm down. That's what you like to see. Yeah, parent and child power shouldn't get the job done. Oh, sheesh. Oh, barnacles. This is the right way, correct? Hey, lady. I'm a rookie breeder, but I'll do my very best. All right, fine. Have it your way. My hair is still floppy. It's kind of early. I've been I've been slacking this morning. I was tired. I wasn't. I I always I always try to fight what's called the Pax plague coming back from Pax. I always do my absolute best to fight that, but uh, sometimes it slowly catches up with me. So I've just you know kind of kind of kind of lazy 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 morning around here. Sunday morning rain is falling. Magby's flame body sucks. It just burned my crow gunk and I'm gonna cry right now. Going out into a Togepi. Uh, Yanima, really, I need Yanima to learn Ancient Power. Por favor. I'd really enjoy it if you could, please. Oh, you've only got two Pokemon. So now, with the force of Yanima, we are going to signal your eggs to be beamed right about now. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. Oh, man. Oh, man. I, I wasn't worried, but... I wasn't, I wasn't worried. I actually wasn't. Seven levels up on a Togepi, Peshaw. Peshaw. Where, do I have a burn heal anywhere in my, in my, in my medicine pouch? I do not. 
Do I have a Rost Berry somewhere in my berry pouch? Paralysis, Sleep, Poison, Big Papa. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Nope. I've got a Yachi Berry, though. I've got a Yachi Berry, though. Oh, freshly squeezed milk. Can I buy some Moo Moo Milk here from you, please? I would love that. Of course, all we ever have is Moo Moo Milk. Would I like to add some to your traveling supplies? One dozen. Thank you. Of course, there's 12 to a dozen. I'm glad they tell you that. I'm glad they let you know how many is in a dozen. Like, uh, uh, I don't want to buy a dozen. Route 215, Celestic Town and Slaysand Town. We came from Slaysand Town and we got a Route 215 encounter. And is this considered fog? I did not think that was considered fog. And then let's switch somebody out for Rash because he's right up front. Um, let's put, let's put Ren up front, actually. Let's put Ren up front. We can grab a Route 215 encounter as well. Uh, put that in the box for all that egg hatch and goodness that we get going on in an egg lock. And you have a bronze ore. <laughs> you fool. Fly, you fool. Oh, I whispered. Now I miss Berto. Berto. All right. Le let's just bite. You're, you're steel psychic, right? Maybe you're just steel right now. Yikes, he's gonna hit, he's gonna confuse Rami, okay. Mm hmm Whatever you wanna do, bud. Whatever you feel like doing, whatever floats your boat. Do Bronzor's own boats. All right, hit him with a superpower run. You got this, breakthrough, breakthrough! There we go. I've been missing out on my Ren action, man. Been missing on it, there we go. And now I can switch out because nobody likes attack and defense drops. Ever. Ever. All right. Uh, shield on. Mm. You're rock and steel. You're not going to appreciate I don't care if I'm minus one. You're not going to appreciate this. You really aren't. Let's go, Ren. Yeah, and I've got some levels on you, too. I've got some gains on you, big dog. <gasps> Calm down. Calm down, Ren. Too strong. Too strong. Ren might evolve this episode, too. Which I am a thousand percent okay with. Completely honest. Total honesty. Full disclosure. I'm okay with that. All right, uh, we got a 215 encounter over here and it's gonna be a, doesn't matter what it is, cause I'm gonna hatch an egg. Sravia! Get the counter going. I wanna see that counter being updated. Um, hmm. What do I do to, what do I do? Oh, and you've got intimidate, of course, too. What do I do go out into? I feel like an intimidated seed bomb could be good. Let's go for a seed bomb. I'm minus one. I'm minus one, and I'm pretty sure flying resists it. All right, let's go for another one. There we go. All right, let's just toss a gray ball at it. There we go. Stravia! Count it. Let me use a potion. Or a moo moo milk, rather. There we go. All right. Now we can hatch ourselves an egg. Where do I? Oh, I have to go around here. Aha! I knew I, I knew I had this. What is that? A max ether. Interesting. All right. And we move on over yonder. And we travel around here. And then we go over here. And then I cut this tree right here. And then I'm a battle of trainer. And then I think we're at a new city. Maybe? We spend so much time over in Salesian Town. I don't even know. I don't even know. You come along with your heart pounding. You think you can win like that? Hey I'll fight you. My foot's not in the shot. I'll fight you. <laughs> All right, my chop. All right, what you got for me, big dog? You ain't got nothing. Hold these watermelons. Look at your little scrawny arms. You can hold these watermelons. Ooh, I guess you can hold one. You can hold one watermelon, I suppose. But can you hold a second one? Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right. What, Machop, what kind of hairstyle you have? I shouldn't talk. I haven't done my hair yet this morning. Hopefully, hopefully by the time this goes up, I've done my hair for the stream and whatnot. <laughs> it's just kind of lying everywhere <laughs> right now. All right, Rengard level 30. Two more levels. Um, Machop again? Cool. I'm... Bet. All right, Gregory, you can keep sending in these Machop, and I'm going to keep tossing some watermelons their way. 
Juggle these watermelons. I can't handle the watermelons. They couldn't. They could not. Goodbye. I said good day, sir. I said good day. No, no, you've got... Why do you just own three Machop? I know you're a black belt, but like, that's really like, I'm sure there's other fighting Pokemon in Sinnoh for you to catch. Other than these three Machop. These are, this is my Machop, and this is my Machop, and this is my Machop. Like, like Gregory, what are you doing, bud? What are you, what are you doing over there, man? All right, is this item worth it? The fist plate. All right, the power of defeated giants infuses this plate. Um, so I can actually give the fist plate I can actually give that to Rash to power up his cross chops. And then I can give the cleanse tag just to Ren over here. Perfect. Perfect. And apparently I can just, if I have cut, I can like shortcut my way through here. Is that how this is working? Interesting. A Ross berry would be wonderful. Petcha berries. Blook berries. I don't want a Blook berry. I will go up here and grab this uh, item over here, though. A Hyper Potion. Okay. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Oh. And then we already got our encounter over here. I'm just going to seed bomb you a few times for the experience. And by a few times, I mean goodbye. Stravia! Keep the counter going. Keep it going. Oh, there's a trainer right here, too. Oh, that's right. We walked past him because we went up and around to fight his brother. That's what we did. That's what we did. What do you have for me, Derek? Crow gunk. Okay. All right. That's fine. <laughs> Bet you never seen a blue grotto. Bet you never seen that. Um. So I'm just gonna seed bomb you, and hopefully you don't like have poison jab. Rash didn't learn poison jab leveling up, so I don't see why this thing should. Yeah. Ooh boy. Revenge isn't like counter, right? Oh yeah, we're chilling. We are 50 shades of fine right now. That's, I am 50 shades of fine right now. Perfect. Okay. So now we can keep heading around. This is like one big maze, isn't it? So I came around through here. Bruh, where do I go? Now we came from this way. Let me go up and around. And then we went over here. Battled him, made fun of his Pokemon. Oh, I go up. Okay. I get it now. I get it now. Okay. And then I can cut. There we go. Okay. I, I, I was about to say, I thought I vaguely remembered, like, cut being some some really cool, uh, some really cool feature. Like, being able to being able to skip through kind of, not, not really skip through this area, but just kind of make it shorter, less with the random encounter or the wild encounters and stuff. Nathaniel and all his crow gunk, man. I tell you. I tell you. See, you could have had a crow gunk, Gregory, but no, you decided I'm gonna have the three, Ma the the wandering macho brothers over here. See, bomb you. You're gonna taunt me. Okay, bite. Nope, Machop can't handle this. Machop don't want the work. We're in good level 31. Metatite. You see, bomb there. Boop. There we go. Awesome. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. What does ether do? Doesn't it like replace my Doesn't it can I use that on Ren C bomb? There we go. Cool beans. Cool beans, and then I've got a super potion that I can use on Ren right here. I think we're gonna evolve Ren this episode. I think that's what's gonna happen. With all these trainers. I think that's exactly what's gonna happen right here. A full heal. Oh, I can use that on Rash. That's something you like to see. I can use one of those on Rash, and then I'll use a Super Potion and put Rash out front for the experience. For this double battle. Is it storming outside? Or is that my heat turning on? I can't... <laughs> I can't tell. I have no idea. I heard, like, something. Normally, that's thunder. I've never heard it, but then I, like, heard it keep going, and I think it's the heater turning on. I'm not sure. That's very interesting. Oh, that, that Abra was faster than me. All right. Let's go this double battle here, and then afterwards, yeah, I think Ren should, I think Ren should evolve right now. 32, right? 32, right? Oh, Veilstone's the next gym. Okay. All right. 
a strain of destiny of Maya sent out Gligar and Rosalia. All right, that's fine by me. I don't know if I want Rash around for that Gligar if it knows like wing attack or something. That's my only concern. So I think I actually want to double up on the Gligar. Let's fake out the Gligar and then let's seed bomb it as well. Yeah, Gligar, you get out of here. Mmm, yeah, it's not looking good for your boy Rash. I might just I might just move him on out. Oh, that seed bomb's doing some damage. Oh, and then the leech seed animation. Alright, so let's seed bomb the Gligar again. And then let's put. Mm. Let's put Yanima in. Let's put Yanima in because she's almost about to learn ancient power, and once she levels up learning ancient power, that's a that, that's a that's a big win right there. That's what you like to see right there. All right, Rosalia set up T spy. Oh, hold on. Speaking of league battles. Speaking of league battles, all right, let's get the Gligar out of here. So that way the wing attacking menace that is that thing can go away. All right, everybody gain everybody gains experience. You gain some experience and you gain some experience and you gain a level. Drift Blim. Okay. So we're going to bite the Drift Blim. And we're going to pursue the Drift Blim as well. So we're going to bite the Drift Blim again. And then we're going to Silver Wind the Roselia. <gasps> the crit, guys! It lived on like one! Yanima, no! The crit, Gus, dude. How many crits, man? How many crits, man? Come on now. How many crits? How many times can this can this happen, man? I just keep getting crit to death, dude. Oh, and Rash did... Oh, cool. I'm glad we sent in Rash for that. Man... Man. I was a crit too! Uh Alright, there we go. Crit for crit. Get your Roselia out of here. Yanima, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Yanima. That's not what you like to see ever. Ever, ever, ever. Get this weasel out of here. What is that? Four down, two to go? Uh, I was so excited to have a tinted lens yen mega. Ah, I'm getting I'm getting rash out of here right now. That's a large fact. That is a humongous fact. I'm going out into Sajaki ASAP. I don't want that. Oh, and Sajaki has Swift Swim. I could have went. Uh, I, I, with that Roselia, I didn't want to. That was. I was just thinking. I was like, Swift Swim Sajaki could be put in the finest of business right now. But I did not want that. I don't know if Ren's going to level up after this double battle. Just with everybody switching out, like the experience split and everything. Uh, Licky Tongue. Licky Tongue. Superpower and Aqua Jet. Rain boosted Aqua Jet and a superpower should knock you out. Yeah, oh, easy. Easy mo- Is this easy mode? That's my D.Va impression, by the way. There we go. That should be it. I think. Oh, look! Okay, something something good happens in this battle, too. Ren wants to learn Leech Seed. Uh, I'll keep the old moves. Thanks, though, bud. Appreciate you. Oh, man. The heartache. I'm... Bruh. Bruh. And Ren is evolving. Yes. The monster that is Torterra. There we go. That's at least something, right? Oh, man. Look at him. Look at him. Oh my goodness. Shiny Torterra is so cool. Ren wants to learn Earthquake. Bet. Yeah, let's forget a move for Earthquake. Let's forget Bite for Earthquake, please. 
earthquake, seed bomb, and superpower? Dude, don't mess with me. Do not mess with me, man. Alright. Let's check out those stats. Let's check out those stats. Oof. What a monster. Does everybody have Pokerus now? Because it transferred over? Yep, everybody has Pokerus except for Yanima now. Except for Yanima. Oh, and Veilstone City's right over this way. That's cool. Oh. That's what I needed. I wanted to go to Celestic Town, but there were some Pokemon in the way. Who knows why they're there, but they're not budging. Alright, Veilstone City. Oh, some more galactic nonsense coming. Oh, I remember this area. I remember this area. The, the, like, the mall and stuff is here too, right? Let's go heal up. We do have an egg to hatch, and we do have to, unfortunately, bury Yanima here. The crit gust, man. I, li I knew I lived another one. Bruh. Oh, I gotta go to move or organize move Pokemon. That's what it is. I always forget what it is. Oh my goodness. The legends. The legends that are here, man. Ugh. Alright, let's grab what did we catch? Stravia! That's what we got. Alright. Alright, so let's get the random number generator out. Generates. We have a box five. All right, and eggs one through 30, we have 25, so that is right here. We have crazy 22, crazy 22. Thank you for supporting the Pokemon Platinum Egg Lock. I do appreciate it. Let's see what on earth this egg is going to be, and it is a, if it ever wants to, can I grab the item off you? I can't, man, you really think that would, you really think that would be something, wouldn't it? All right, hatch any day now. Oh no, this isn't what I wanted. This isn't what I wanted. <laughs> no, no, there we go. So I'm just curious because the other one hatched, but this one is not hatching. So crazy, thank you for sending in an egg. Unfortunately, it is not hatching. So we are going to put this right over here. And then we are going to grab another, what was it, box five? Yeah, there's that story of you. All right, let's generate a new one. And you guys thought I wasn't gonna be ready with this. Ha <laughs> ha! Psych. Box three. Eggs one through 30. We have number 10, which has already been gotten. 12, 11, 10. All right, let's generate a new egg out of there. 20. Here we go. We have downtime. Thank you to ever sent in downtime. I appreciate it very, very much. Let's see what we have here. We have a... Feebass, and that is a shiny Feebass as well. So I need to make sure the level up move set is fine. Thank you for sending in downtime. We have here boop boop. Oh, I'm I'm naming it a Feebass. Good job, Chase. <laughs> Good job, Chase. Downtime. All right. There we go. Now I know how to spell. And doesn't it have to, like, level up through beauty? Like, evolve through beauty in Gen 4? Isn't that what it is? All right, a Calm Nature, Swift Swim Ability, Splash, Iron Tail, Dragon Breath, and Hypnosis. Let me check here. Splash. Yup. Iron Tail. Nope. So it can learn Dragon Breath by breeding. And it can learn that, but it cannot learn Iron Tail. I cannot learn Iron Tail, unfortunately. So, what we're going to do is we are going to put Downtime back in the box. Because, unfortunately, it cannot learn Iron Tail. And we're going to try one more egg here. And hopefully, hopefully, just maybe, it works. Alright, so where are we in? Box 3? Where's that Sarabia at? There we go. Alright. Box 1 through 10. That's a letter. That's not a number. There we go. Box one. Eggs one through 30. Eight. I, this Pokemon does not have a nickname, so thank you for sending in this Pokemon. Let's see what we have here. <gasps> it's Riolu! Oh 
my goodness, it's a shiny Riolu too. Yo, we have to name this Icarus after the, the Riolu in the shiny race that we've got going on right now. So to whoever sent in this Riolu, thank you. Hopefully you can identify it by the moveset. Um, unfortunately, if nicknames don't stick, it, tra it just defaults to the characters that that egg was given. Let's check out Icarus here really quickly. Make sure everything is good. Naive nature with inner focus. This looks like a legit Riolu, but let us double check here really quickly. Crunch, yup. Vacuum wave, yup. Blaze kick, yup. Bullet punch, yup. This is a awesome Riolu. So we do have to make Icarus shiny really quickly. And we do also need to get him to the appropriate level, but I think we're going to do that in time for the next episode. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you guys so much for watching. Of course, if you guys have enjoyed, show some love on the like button down below. If you guys are new, feel free to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to answer the question of the day in the comment section down below as well. All that being said, guys, I want to remind you to be great and do great. I'm going to let this outro bang. I'm going to talk to you all soon. Later. Later.